All right, so what's on, guys? Yeah. As you can see, see something lurking inside there. Uh, you know, just been kind of busy. Um, got her in last week. And so the reason why I got the hood propped up like that is because, you know, that piece is hitting. Uh, the throttle body hits there. Uh, so it's between, you know, removing, you know, some of that material, the skeleton of the hood. Or, you know, raising it, as you see, I got, um, you know, like a spacer there that I'm going to go get some bolts for and see how that works out. But anyhow, let me see if I can do this one second. All right, so I had to turn on the lights for this. So anyhow, um, this kit that I had bought, the cheap, uh, you know, eBay, it actually worked out pretty well. Um, you know, I thought I had to maybe do some redesign or you know but the only thing I had to do was just open up the holes on one of the sides um, that go to the block um, so you know as you can see it's got its solid mounts there with the hockey puck and then you can see how close it sits to the um, uh, the cross member there um, and then even the sway bar from the Z um, passes, you know, as, uh, as of that, so that's pretty cool. Now, um, you know, you see the alternator out. See, the kind of shitty part is, uh, you know, working there. I gotta probably, you know, like, clean up these wires or, you know, get them, so the whole thing that we're doing is, uh, I don't know if you guys seen the Soho kit for the, um, 350s but basically it uses stock stock exhaust now the stock exhaust um they don't uh work on here because they hit the firewall in the back oh like they'll go come on i have it on the ground i don't feel like my hands dirty um and then hit the firewall in the back so you can trim it and cut it so um what i was gonna do was flip them and you know this side it comes out here and then the other one um, I would have to do some short cutting because the alternator comes here but then I don't want to run you know like short headers uh, because you know that doesn't help the motor breathe so with the Soho kit uh, my brother-in-law and I um, what do you call it basically run the exhaust the headers out the back I'm gonna come back this way for the the turbo and have the turbo sit here um you know have like the flange sit here turbo facing that way exhaust shooting straight back oh whoops my bad so have the turbo you know compressor facing that way turbine there and then shooting straight back and then to connect the passenger side to the um driver's side is just having a pipe that comes along the back underneath the tranny um, or where I can get it to clear to then join up with this one and then that leads to my um, my turbo so that's that's the plans uh, for it but like I said um, you know anyway you guys doing this yeah those uh, mount kit uh, oh yeah shit watch this shifter location all right so here inside um here goes the shifter location and as you can see it's pretty close to stock it's actually better than how i had it with the um the z32 even though it was close but anyhow so there goes first second third fourth fifth sixth and then here goes my little reverse there i just hate how how close how reverse and and thing is but like that yeah to go down that'll be reverse and then like from fifth to six like that it's like it kind of comes back down a little bit uh, i remember driving my friend's scr and i was freaking grinding six gear like going into reverse that shit was annoying but you know i got used to it but at least it was a you know it's a pretty decent location um yeah with that i just need to get a six speed 
<laughs> gear. I don't know. Yeah, I would leave it a five. People think it's a five speed. But uh, besides that, you know, she looks good. It's just a matter of cleaning up. And then, like, I got to figure out new routes for my, um, well, I'm going to do a half inch line. I, I made it here, especially with the exhaust being on this side and how the stock, you know, um, fuel lines come here. I was like, I'm just going to do hard lines and, uh, you know, get that squared away because I don't want to have to deal with no crazy shit. But, all right, guys. So, hopefully, uh, I'm going to go to Harbor Freight and uh, chop these manifolds. Like, they got these stock manis. Uh, and then I chop it like right there and then I put a v-band and then build that pipe to go across the back and then the other one v-band and then I'll be like a y that then goes into one pipe to feed the turbo and then bam, the next one off but we'll see all right guys like